let's go ahead and do this one really quick. So write the correct formula for magnesium sulfide. Okay, magnesium generally will, or always, will go to Mg2 plus, like that. Sulfur will always go to S2 minus, plus 2 minus 2, that equals 0. So the formula must be MgS. That's the formula for magnesium sulfide. Mercury 1 oxide. Okay, so this one might throw you for a little bit because you got the mercury 1. But even then, it really shouldn't ham hamper you too much. Mercury is Hg. 1 means it has a plus 1 charge. Okay. Ox oxygen, on the other hand, always has a minus 2 charge. Okay? So if we added up plus 1 and minus 2, we wouldn't get 0, right? We need one more positive here. So two mercuries plus one oxygen equal mercury oxide, or mercury one oxide. So it's going to be Hg2. Oh. Now let's do aluminum oxide. Aluminum is normally Al3 plus. Oxygen again is 2 minus. Okay, if we do that, we don't get 0. What we'll have to do is multiply this by 2. So 2 times 3 equals 6. And multiply this by 3. Okay, because 3 times 2 equals 6. When we do that, we get Al2O3, which is aluminum oxide. And then finally, sodium is always Na plus. Chlorine is always Cl minus. Plus one minus one equals zero. So we could just take that straight away over. NaCl. Hopefully it's making sense.